little off topic is the lack of recent uploads. That's due to me having recent assess lots of uh, lots of assessments in uh, the recent weeks. So I'm just basically finished the last assessment today, and I will be able to continue on the upload thing over my holidays, which is coming up. There's only been a few uploads in 2016, and hopefully there'll be a bit more by the end of it. So we're just going to quickly explore how to install um, the benefits of installing Dota through uh, not, <laughs> not Dota um, Blender through Steam. So um, with Blender, it's Steam. Let's open up Steam Store. So if you don't have a Steam account, I'd highly recommend getting a Steam account. If you don't have a Steam account, then you should probably get one just for this reason, because when we come to the store here, we can just type in Blender. A load of games will come out. They're not what we want. There it is. Blender. So we click on Blender here and go down and you just click free. This will add Blender to your library. Blender is already in your Steam library. Go to my library, I'll find Blender. And where is it? Blender. There it is. It says it's in my library. But which it is, and now I have to install it for it to actually appear. And uh, you just go through this process, click next, etc. I'm just going to cancel it, but my internet is dreadfully slow. Um, but the benefits of using Blender on Steam is A, you have the whole Steam uh, community support for Blender. So if you have any problems, you'll be able to ask other people who use Blender. Um, it also updates automatically when there's an update instead of you having to update um, from the web browser. This will update automatically and you can set that using the Steam settings. Um, it offers it for like Steam OS as well as um, Mac, Windows and Linux. And the, the, the main um, benefit of using Blender on Steam is just the updates because I have Blender here, and I'm on 2.7b, 7.6b, and I only found out 7.7 7 was out, and I have no um, like notification come up from Blender or anything. So um, from now on, I'm going to um, use Blender through Steam. And when you um, once it's installed, you just go to your library, find Blender, and you just click play like that, and it'll just boost it up through there, and you'll close it, etc. So that's how you install uh, Blender via Steam. So hopefully there'll be more tutorials incoming, and I shall catch you in my next video.